Well, my name is Josh with Non-Perishable Marketing, and I'm trying to figure out how do I embed a spreadsheet, uh, which we've designed our own little calculator, in an Excel file. How do I embed that into a WordPress website? Um, so I looked at EASA. Uh, this company is very responsive. I've been able to talk to people there. Their capability is much more kind of cloud computing, allowing a lot of people to activate uh, a version of Excel on a server somewhere and it's all web-based um, but it's not really web-based because it's tied to a back-end server as far as I understand it uh, and it's a few thousand dollars per user or per instance of being active at the same time so that's not really what I want because I just want to be able to embed my calculator onto a spreadsheet so I found this one uh, spreadsheet converter it's like a hundred bucks you buy the software once you have purchased the software, uh, actually you can do a free trial too. If you do a free trial, they're going to send you this, which um, I, I don't I don't know what to do with it. I mean I, I don't know how to get it onto my, my onto my freaking website. So anyway, um, but if you, I bought it anyway because I, I I I just I'm trying to get it to work. So uh, let's go ahead and open up Excel, and you'll see right here, this is what it is. Um, it just adds another tab with some additional functionality. Um, we've already put in our license key, so we're not using the free version. Um, now I want to just go ahead and open up the calculator I'm wishing to convert. And once you've done that, you need to make sure that the calculator is um, unprotected. So let me enter in my password. Unprotect the sheet, go to spreadsheet converter, and then click on convert. Uh, once you do that, next. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. Using color, unlocked cells or input cells. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Create tabs for. No, we don't have any other sheets. All right, um, so hit next. Let's just go through it and see what it does. I'm saying put it on the desktop and finish. Once it finishes, it does pull up a um, a web browser and show you that yes in fact it is working so uh, let's just take a look at this our break-even number and our estimated value let's say it was 1500 Oops. and you can see that our uh, our numbers are changing So it, it appears to be working, and it's embedded onto a, a, a web page. However, how do I get it on my web page? That still has yet to be determined. Um, that's the problem I'm coming into. I, 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 I go to my website, and I try to embed it as an iframe, and it's still not working. I'm following the instructions here, talking about... Actually, the other thing about this website is it's kind of um, kind of interesting how you have to go about finding the information. Yeah, uh -huh. finding the information about how to how to do this stuff. I wish that you guys could fix that. Thank you. Have a nice day.